Hey, it's Andre, and well, I guess I have a bad habit of overpowering Spitfires. You're looking at the SK3 50 by 55 can motor. Look at this thing, it's huge. So this guy in conjunction with the Talon 90 that Chris Gooden sent me and a big 16 by eight prop. And of course 6S power means this 3D Spitfire, 3D Print Lab Spitfire is gonna be crazy. I'm looking forward to it. Now I haven't been printing, I just, February is always such a weird month. I was looking back at last year's notes and same deal. The weather's terrible and I get busy doing other things and I really just have not had the hobby mojo in me. I'm hoping tomorrow I get to go flying. I've got some stuff that I need to set up that I can take with me. And if I do get out again, it'll just be one of those just fly for the pure sake of flying. I do need to get back into the Spitfire because I finally have all the components here to actually complete the aircraft. The only thing I'm missing is I, I ordered the wrong spinner, so that goes into a bin somewhere. Um, but I've got all my servos, and these are like just simple metal gear servos, which will do the job for the flaps, the ailerons, the rudder and elevator. I got my retracts and my sprung struts, and I cheated and bought some wheels because, well, let's just get things done kind of thing. Um, I'm gonna put an XT90 onto this guy because obviously I'm using my big 6S packs. I may um, build a uh, Y harness and use some 3S 4000s first flight, but I've got a feeling the aircraft should be pretty stable and reliable enough for me to trust it with my precious 6S 5200 packs, or sorry, 6200s. I am very, 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 very patiently waiting for spring because I get to fly this thing, I get to fly the Hawk and so many other wonderful airplanes I didn't get to fly last year. So yes, February is such a terrible month, and if I had the motivation, I would be getting a whole lot of other little sub small projects like that. The smaller Spitfire done, I need to reprint that wing because after evaluating some of the cracks from, from the bad tosses last year, it's just, it needs to be replaced. Um, you know, need to fork up my trucks. I did get some connectors in. These are Traxxas to XT60s, uh, male and female, so I can charge the the stock battery and then also use my two s4000s in that vehicle and a few other little odds and sods came in but the main parts were these two hobby king orders with some really nice pieces for this plane uh and again like i said this motor is so big uh this is this is a hefty piece of kit uh long term wise i'm not sure how long the spitfire will honestly last i i don't have you know my goal is to bring this thing to flight fest in ohio in july uh, and and fly it and enjoy it but long term i don't know how viable this airframe is and whether i'm going to like reprint constantly new pieces and stuff um so whatever this stuff is for long term it will probably get transplanted into something like a hangar hangar nine or some other airplane that i can repurpose a lot of this stuff for but we'll see maybe the spitfire the 1700 millimeter 3d spitfire 3d printed spitfire will be a viable aircraft uh other than that saturday it looks decent for flying like i said my goal is to take whatever i can so i probably should charge some batteries tonight but i'll probably leave them until tomorrow morning and just charge what i need to bring with me so i just you know not rushing i have all day i'm giving myself the whole day to enjoy myself and go flying because i haven't done that in a couple weeks and then sunday is podcast rc after hours we've got to do a podcast and we'll have some fun chris and mike i don't know if mike will be there but chris and i will be there for sure and we'll get together and have a good time talking about some of the recent releases in the hobby industry so there we go. Apologies for last week's lack of uh, Florida flying updated. I was busy doing some work stuff and uh, just never got around to doing a show all weekend long. So there we go. Happy flying. Have a great weekend. Thanks for watching.